Hello guys, despite my lack of clothing, it is not the morning, it is the afternoon. Welcome to a new vlog. You want to be on the vlog? Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. You look like an island boy. Are you an island boy? Thank you, darling. Come with us, come out onto this island with us just for one day, just for 10, 15, 20 minutes, however long this video ends up being, and have a day off with us, have a day relaxing with us, have a day chilling with us on this beautiful, stunning island. This is the name of the island. If you search this on Google Maps and zoom out, you will see just how remote it is, just how far away it is. This is our room. If you have missed some of the previous vlogs, this is where we're staying. It's called a Sunset Villa here at Club Paradise, Palawan. And a couple of steps. Count the steps with me, even though you can't see my feet. Count the seconds it took me to get here. Oh, the sun is out today and it is a beautiful, beautiful day here in Quran. I just, I'm constantly lost for words here. Honestly, I was just having a little workout on the beach, doing some push-ups on sand, getting some squats in. There is a gym here as well, went to last night. But something about working out on the beach and then just cooling off in the water, you can't beat that, you really can't. Starting to upload some Instagram stories from here and I got friends back home messaging me like, oh my God, this place looks unbelievable. I'm like, yes, get yourself here, get yourself to the Philippines. If you're watching this and you've never been to this country, maybe you stumbled across this video, stumbled across our channel from some of our other videos maybe, and you've never been to this country, please give it a go. Whoa, look at that. You can just cool off. Water on your feet. You just have to come here. There's other countries that have similar beaches, but I don't know if there's anywhere quite as untouched, quite as peaceful, quite as laid back. And also with how friendly all the staff and everyone are here. Everyone we've met has been super lovely, super nice with Coda. Yeah, today's agenda is to soak up the sun, soak up the island vibes. I can't even look at the camera, it's so bright. And just enjoy, because we leave tomorrow by the way, so just enjoy this last day in paradise before moving on to another destination in the Philippines. Comment below, we're not going back to Manila, not going back to the condo. We are on a bit of a traveling route for the next few weeks actually. So we're not gonna see our condo for a little while. So comment below, get your guesses in where we're heading off to. We're jumping on another flight with Cebu Pacific tomorrow. Ah, uh, back in the shade. And this is nice, that's all we've been doing, just doing a bit of stuff on the laptop, coming down to the beach, soaking up the sun, jumping in the water, then coming back in the shade. They've got this foot thing here. Coda likes doing it for me. Uh oh. Uh oh, where's your hat? There's your hat. There's your hat. Cool, backwards hat. Yeah, they have this thing here so you don't get sand on your feet when you come back. Don't screenshot these feet pics and sell them, guys. Shouldn't be giving feet for free, you know, but there we go. Just want to show you. Koda loves doing this, don't you? You coming back down to the beach? Did you go show the vlog the crabs? Oh yeah, you found some crabs, didn't you? Did you? find the crabs? Lucy's been living in bikinis for the last few days. I know, I keep washing my hair every night here and then I just get it all sandy again and salty. Yeah. This is sort of constantly messy, but it's all good. So this, this resort we're at, I don't know if George mentioned it, we're in Club Paradise in Palawan, Quran. Oh, look at that glistening water, unreal. I just can't go over this place. But there's so much nature here. So we've said it in the videos before, but there's bats that fly from the island to the mainland every evening. There's monitor lizards everywhere, although I haven't actually seen one today. I think maybe because it's so hot today, they're, they're hiding out in the shade. There's also loads of crabs. So if I show you guys here, they're little hermit crabs. So I'll give you a little close up. Just here. Underneath these rocks, there's loads, they're everywhere. Don't close your eyes, wait until the night is over. I'll show you paradise, but hang on just a little longer. I will be hey, night night, afternoon nap. All the babies first. And it does make us think like we spent so much time in Manila when we were here. I know it's so hard to stand on the sand, isn't it? We'll make this quick. Um, but when we're here, we're like, oh, island life is just the best like eating fresh tropical fruits 
walking on the beach. I feel like we're exercising so much here. Yeah, we're sweating. The sun is good for you. We the sun's had amazing. fresh fish yesterday. Just walking everywhere. Locally caught. Local, fr local fresh fish, loads of vegetables. Island life's really cool and it's chilled as well. We're kind of not doing loads here. We're kind of taking our time and we're waking up whenever we want to wake up. 5 a.m. with Coda, love lunch. <laughs> it's just such a lovely way of life. It is, but could, could you live here? Could As in you... the resort? No, no, like island life. If there's no resort here? Like um, eight miles from home, they literally yeah, live on Chargal. I think I could spend a good few months, but I think like I'd, permanent. Miss, I'd miss my like, I don't know. Some other, you're a city I'm girl, me. you like I'm city, a city as well. Girl. I love a good coffee shop, I love fast Wi-Fi, although the Wi-Fi is quite good here actually. Oh, 100 meg up. Uh, the Wi-Fi is amazing actually, for where we are, it's incredible. Yeah, I'm the same, I'm not sure I could live here permanently i do lo also love the island life but like yeah i think it would be really interesting for lucy and i to do like a longer a longer island stint like imagine like a six month island trial i think i could definitely do three months really yeah that's a long time but i don't think i could do permanent because i just miss my like luxuries in life not that this is luxurious, but in a very different way. This is like yeah. absolute pure paradise. Do you know what? But like I said, coffee shops, yeah. shopping malls. I don't know. The other, the other big thing for me is, as you can see from my reaction on videos, every time I come to a place like this, even though we are super, super blessed, like multiple times a year, we're on incredible beaches like this. I just can't believe that. Past me is, past me sat in my office at my old corporate job is like, what? Oh, good boy. You cleaning? You sweeping? Sweet, sweet. Yeah, we are super blessed to be here in places like this throughout the year. However, as you can see from my reactions on the vlog, I am so wowed and amazed and in awe when I step into places like this after it's been a little while and it's new again, it's fresh again, and it's incredible and I'm blown away and I'm speechless. I would hate, absolutely hate for that effect to ever be less than it is like it's already less if i'm totally honest it's already less than it was of course from when i first ever saw a beach like this because i've experienced it now but i do still get that magical feeling ev every time we come to places like this so i would hate for that to be taken away if i lived on an island would would that get less and less and it would just become so normal and I wouldn't be wowed by it. I enjoy that feeling so much, so I would hate for that to be taken away. Here we have some lovely blue skies, but behind me, well actually no, behind you, let me just turn the camera around. Guys, a storm is coming. That was not a sound effect. The thunder literally happened as I said the storm's coming. I'm so excited. I love storms. So the super dark clouds behind me here, I guess are gonna come over this way and it's gonna break up this heat a bit this is needed and then maybe we can actually go swimming in the pool because the sun's quite a bit less intense i think you saw in yesterday's video i got very burnt when i went snorkeling and my legs are raw um so yeah this is exciting because we can literally have front row seats to this storm coming in across us oh i can't actually get over this place it's heaven it's paradise and i know that's in the name but it's i'm speechless every time i look here i'm like really and now this turquoise water with the contrasting dark grey skies, it's like a painting. We've got a perfect storm We don't care about the second wind Something else to take for Someone else to keep us warm The sun's gone. <laughs> Everything's gone very dark. Only ourselves to blame.
the start or at the end Is it really worth knowing the answer to It is not what we demand There's no answer written in the sand He's obsessed Mom. with these. The one thing we find here in the Philippines is that a lot of baby snacks have got sugar in and the ones that don't are super expensive. These were like nearly 400 pesos for a small bag. So yeah, but he loves it. So it's all good. It's worth every penny, isn't it? <laughs> You're the cheekiest chappy in the world. Does he look charmed to you? Maybe. Have you got what? a charm? What? How many are you going to eat? What? He's demolished his whole bag in about but, two minutes. Okay, we are about to have dinner. Well, we were about to go and have dinner ourselves. And then the manager came up to us. He's like, whoa, whoa wait, guys, wait, guys. We're preparing something for you. Give us, give us a little bit of time. Hello, mate. Fancy seeing you here. Just running down to the beach first for sunset. Oh, look at that. Absolutely stunning. Wow, wow, wow. Look at the sky. This is such such a beautiful sunset here. I think this could be, oh my God, my hair. So my hair goes crazy with the humidity. I think this could be better than, look at that man. I'm just looking at the little screen on the camera. I think this could be better than last night's potentially. I think it might be. And last, if you were watching the previous vlog, you would have seen our reaction to the sunset last night. Yes, as I was just saying, before I spotted the sunset, the manager here was like, we're setting something up for you. Give us a minute. You're gonna have dinner on the beach tonight. So we are, in for a little bit of a treat. We had a little sneak peek and it looks like just around there, they're actually setting something up for us. So yeah, it looks like dinner on the beach tonight, which will be really, really nice because this is such an amazing place. And to have dinner actually on the beach with sunset, we're having it a little bit earlier because of Coda. Um, so yeah, very, very excited for that. Wow. Oh my God, this is our table. I thought we had this a seat is... in the restaurant tonight, but the resort had other ideas. Yeah, what? <laughs> Oh, they've even put Coda's high chair out. Wow, wait, what? This is mad. This is so nice. Look at that. Oh, wow, that is, that's like the, the best view, the best spot you could possibly get. Are we getting married? Are we having, it might be. Is this our wedding? No one told me. Maybe, you never know. I wouldn't be surprised. What is it? I told you there'd be a big light. Yeah, it's your chair. You want to get in? Wow. Oh, they've got like a big like chandelier in here and everything. This feels like classic old George and Lucy on a beach having dinner. There's actually lightning going on behind George, so I think <laughs> hopefully we're all good. <laughs> I mean, I don't think it's metal. I think it's, oh, it's made oh, of bamboo. He, he's ready to take our order. Oh, is he? Where is he? Yeah. Huh? Yeah, shall we oh, order? I didn't Thank see you. you. <laughs> I could just see the lights. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hello, evening. <laughs> Thank the you. Island Alamo. Yes. Yes, that's the one. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you very much. We make it sound more boring than it is. It's yeah, very exciting. Yeah, of course we do. That's the real name. And can I please have a virgin mojito? One virgin mojito. Thank you. For you? I'm good, actually. All right. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank Bye. you very much. Boat crossing now, but it's pitch black. Freaky. That would be freaky, wouldn't it? Mm. But kind of fun. I can't believe we went night swimming once, Yeah, twice. where was that? We did it in Cambodia, definitely, but maybe, maybe somewhere else as well. The idea of deep, dark water in the dark where you can't see kind of makes my heart race in a bad way. The bats are heading out. We have got the best view for the bats. Yeah. This is so cool. This is so special. Wow, this is, feels very surreal. We've had such a beautiful day on the island. We're all feeling kind of like a bit sunburned, but not in a bad way, like a hot, nice radiator way. Uh, <laughs> what? I don't the know. The things you say on the vlog are so funny. I feel like... Someone needs to make a compilation of Lucy's random yeah, but sentences. 2% of people watching will be like, I get what she means. And that's who I'm talking to here. I'm talking <laughs> to my 2%. No offence to the rest of you. I'm sure you're all lovely. But honestly, having spent the day on the island and just 
been in the water all day basically we honestly spent maybe two hours in the pool this morning around breakfast and then another two hours this afternoon and we've been walking around the beach we've watched the storm come in we've had some really lovely food we've met loads of animals and ending it in this way like under this I, I kind of feel like we're in a lounge like the chandelier and stuff above us yeah just look up a second it's like we're in someone's living room but they've like picked it up and popped it on a beach it's honestly unreal so huge shout out to club paradise for this setup we weren't expecting no, it. We, we didn't, didn't book it. No, we didn't ask for this no. at all. Super grateful. And thank you for watching these videos because if it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't be here right now. <laughs> Hoda, who, whose water is this? You're under there for 10 minutes, mate. Whose water is it? Mine. No, it's <laughs> mummy's water. It's mummy's. Island Alamo. Amazing. Thank you. There you go. And this wow. one is the signature vegan cheesecake. Oh, wow. Perfect. Thank you so much. Here. Thank Perfect. you. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> Careful, back. you're freaking out. George's Strawberries drunk. on the way. I'm not drunk. I'm tired. We've got a perfect storm. We don't care about the second wind Or something else to take for Someone else to keep us warm Oh, we're learning where to head